Okay, um... I'm gonna- I'm gonna get a little bit more serious now. I was recently made aware of something that happened a few days ago. A little bit less than a week. This guy, going by the name of Elliot Roger, um, posted a YouTube video saying how he was the supreme gentleman and he did not like at all how how girls seem to reject him. He basically thought that by being a nice guy he would get sexual rewards. And he just felt so angry about it he just went on to say how he was how he would murder everybody and needless to say a few days after publishing the video on YouTube um, he goes on a killing spree in uh, Isla Vista California killing if I'm not mistaken six six people and himself now, I know I don't have a lot of subscribers. I know I'm probably this. This probably isn't getting any anybody's attention from um, California. But but seriously, my condolences to all the families affected by this incident. You know, I'm I'm really really sorry. This was done by someone who who was terribly in need of mental therapy and it pisses me off frankly like seriously Elliot Roger pissed me off I don't like him I didn't like him one single bit and here's why dear mister Roger um if you expect to get laid for being a nice guy, you are not a nice guy. I mean, it's not like you're gonna open the door to someone, a young woman, and and say, You're welcome. Now suck my dick. It just doesn't work that way, dude. Like, I know you're dead, but still. And also something else that really tweaked my gears. He was envying douchebags and sexually active men for being practically jerks to girls and driving cheap vehicles yet still getting sex while he being a nice guy and driving a luxury vehicle I may be mistaken but I think it was a BMW or was it a Mercedes well it it was a very expensive vehicle and he assumed that by having money and by being well-mannered, it would get him sex. Um... <laughs> Well-manners and money are not factors for sex. I mean, if you're well-mannered, Obviously, you're gonna get well manners in return, and if you have money, well, obviously, you're gonna get accordingly priced products in return. If you get sex for those, um, it's probably because you added something else to the concoction in order to get that from the other person. It's usually because you were attracted to that person and you played your cards right. If this guy has a friggin' luxury vehicle, and, oh, I believe he was the, the son of some, yeah, he was the son of some, of someone who worked in showbiz, and presumably, um, he, he was a rich kid. So, this guy was pretty much used to being handed things and not working for them, and that is the main factor, amongst other things, on why he didn't feel satisfied when he was getting nothing for his good manners and for being a nice guy 
and the supreme gentleman. Uh, and just look at the guy, he is a sociopath. He is a sociopathic douchebag. Think about it. he has no regards in thinking about others' feelings, uh, girls in this matter. Um, he just wanted to get rid of them. Uh, he doesn't know the value on a human life and how taking one away could affect others, family. And basically he just had a terrible, misconstrued idea of what love is by associating it with, with the sex that he was not getting. What just happened in Isla Vista shouldn't be a message to the whole world to say, Oh no, the moral of the lesson is to not friend zone people, or, or, oh no, the only guys at school or in college are serial killers, oh no. That's obviously, you know, just a small percentage. Like, basically, Mr. Roger was a loud minority. You know, I was a pretty lonely guy in high school, but I obviously am not like that. <laughs> What really gets me thinking about this is the guy's sense of purpose. Like, all of us have some sort of purpose that we give ourselves. Each one of us has an individualized purpose. And obviously, if you don't fulfill that purpose, you know, you feel really, really bad about yourself. For example, my sense of purpose is aimed to... Explore. You know, I have an affinity for curiosity. I just... I've said this before. I like to take the, the road less traveled to see where few people have ever... ever get to see. And usually when I don't get this, for example, the car is under maintenance or if I'm grounded or if the car is grounded, uh, you know, I get pissed off, frankly, because you're taking away from what I like to do. This guy, Elliot Roger, um, his sense of purpose was sex, 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 sex. He obviously didn't get that goal. He said in his video that he was a kissless virgin, or something along those lines. On a side note, um, if you're gonna set a goal for yourself, make sure it's actually attainable because it obviously sucks if you set very high expectations for yourself and you don't actually get them. And I've pretty much said this a million times in the past few minutes, but you know, since he didn't get his goal, he didn't get what he wanted, so he became upset. Therefore, he went on a very extreme form of anger and resorted to killing a bunch of a bunch of people unfortunately in response to this i want all of you who are watching to just do something nice to someone a random act of kindness because you know we live in a fucked up world and showing showing someone that you know it's a little bit different you know it's nice so i'll leave you with that take care and kick ass kiddos